It's London, not the moon. And this demo is important. Leon says it's got a real chance of making people think about the environment. Leon this, Leon that, and that's all I've heard all weekend. I haven't even met him. Neither is she. Uh, you're on thin ice and all. Why? Because you're way too smart to give blue rinses all your life. That's debatable. Well, when I've got my own Saturday job, I've experience. No hairdressing, no London. You're unreal. Look, I think it's great that you've got a hobby and an interest in the environment. A hobby? This is about where we live, the air we breathe. Oh, so you won't want to lift to school in the motor car? No thanks. I'll cycle. And I'm going to London. You can't stop me. What's up? Tom's been a pig, that's all. He doesn't want me. Sorry, he's not letting me go on the deforestation demo next week. What? Well, means we could do something. I'm going. I don't think I'm giving up in what I believe just because Tom says so. Why is this demo so important? Leon says that deforestation is like smoking. The damage is hidden. He says we should be doing anything and everything we can to increase awareness. But well, we can hardly bring the rainforest to Rochdale. Won't be so sure. Shifting the pair of you. We're not going anywhere. We got a job to do here. Uh, I don't think you have. Come again? You're not vandalising our heritage and jeopardising our future. Listen, Sonny, you are really starting to get You're on my son, Neanderthal. If I was, I'd be flipping burgers. Don't you get it? By killing these trees, you're killing the planet. Think about oh, it. Oh, now you put it like that, I know where you're coming from. What have I been doing all these years? Lick, give me a hand. We've got a couple of tree huggers. Lay one finger on us and you'll be sharing a jail cell with someone even uglier than you. <laughs> Maybe we don't have to lay a finger on you, Sonny. Don't move. You won't do anything, you can't. Get the head teacher. He can sort them. We can get back up too. Um, right, we'll send someone down in a minute. Great. Looks like we've run into our first little snag with a building work. Apparently, we have a little protest on our hands. Sounds like one for you, Eddie. Just for a change. Are you looking for? What are you not doing? Get back to registration! <sighs> How did I know it was gonna be you two? Right, we'll talk about this inside. No chance. We're staying put. It wasn't a request. Miss Granger, I seriously suggest you consider your we option. We are not letting this lot rip up in five minutes when it's taken nature a hundred years to create. <laughs> and these trees are gonna make a difference? Absolutely. I know you're a math teacher, sir, but I'm sure even you've heard of photosynthesis. Mika, I would love to stand here and discuss the ins and outs of biodiversity, but this building guarantees a future for pupils who don't have your academic prowess. That's a bit patronising. Well, you've got an MVQ in that already, Brett. What about replanting? We replace all the ones we take out two for one. Trees take ages to grow. What about now, our green space, our environment? You know, this could be considered a criminal act. Civil disobedience, Mr Lawson. There's an honourable tradition of it in this country. Do you know how pathetic that sounds? What's going on, Mika? You lot, do one! We're joining the protest, sir. This is an issue the school magazine can't afford to ignore, sir. And we've got a chance to be part of the story. Don't even think about it. Get. Now! Mm. 